today I will give you introduction of bidirectional DC DC converter which is made by National Infotech and uh, here on front side you can see the main terminals input output terminals gate pulses and sensor output so you can see uh, these terminals will show you the boost connection means input for boost mode and here V1 terminals will show you bug bug input uh, terminals so if you are configuring this DC DC converter in boost operation so this point will be your input termin uh, input point and here this V1 terminals are for your output so from left to right your boost mode operation will be done and in reverse uh, vice versa if you are going to operate this converter in bulk mode operation so you have to connect input here and same you'll you'll get your output here in bulk mode this is your input and this is your output error will show you the all operation here we have used sensor circuits also means uh, input output voltage current and input uh, uh, voltage and current so four quantities we are sensing here you can see this is the, at this point v, v2 voltage will be sensed and same i2 current will be sensed here also v1 voltage will be sensed and i1 current will be sensed all the four quantities after sensing are terminated here so with respect to ground you can measure and sense your voltage current output in the range of 0 to 3 volt okay everything will be calibrated and i'll show you later how to calibrate your input output voltage currents here the main thing is input gate pulses so four terminals are terminated in this uh, section gate pulses section gp1 gp2 and ground and this is 5 volt uh, here uh, no need to connect any 5 volt input so you have to connect only three terminals means g1 g2 g2 and one ground so you can see gp2 means your boost operation switch and gp1 means your bug operation switch so here you have to connect likewise gp2 for boost gp1 for bug but the main notice is use active low pulses so all the uh, operation will be uh, working uh, at this active low gate pulses so because we have used that side that type of uh, gate pulse uh, gate driver circuit here I'll show you some inside the bug boost converter what we have used. So here the main input is of this firing card means control supply for this firing and uh, uh, firing mechanism you can see AC supply. So one mains code power will be given to you by making it on. You can on your firing mechanism here you can see one indication is given green LED is glowing. Now this is our main input. Uh, control supply transformer and now uh, I'll explain you some accessories or inter uh, some detail about your firing card your sensing circuit your IGBT input output your get pulses so here our uh, AC out input is given to our firing card now you can see two identical sections we are looking at so this section is for boost operation this section is for buck operation so what are that uh, blue colored potentiometers so you can see four potentiometers you are uh, watching these are for your offsets okay and these are for your amplitudes so the the near near uh, to this ic two ports are of offsets and this one for current this one for voltage okay means uh, your i2 and v2 this is I2, this is V2. The I2, V2 uh, sensor output uh, ports, you can by varying this port adjust your offset value. Means 1.5 nearly because in bidirectional mode, your current will be uh, negative or positive according to your configuration. So by uh, changing that output state, means uh, by adding some uh, DC value, means offset, you can connect your uh, sensor output with your controller. So here you can add offsets same current amplitude voltage amplitude okay so likewise you can <coughs> calibrate your input output voltage current range here i have calibrated uh, boost operation voltage means this v2 voltage at 60 volt when i will apply 60 volt here 
at this terminal v2 terminal for boost mode operation so i'll sense this 60 volt into 3 volt when i'll connect 60 volt here i'll get 0 to 3 volt here with respect to ground i'll say sense 0 to 3 volt okay because i have calibrated likewise and my i2 current means for boost mode it will be input current so my i2 current i have calibrated at 8 ampere so when whenever 8 ampere current will flow in input i'll get 0 to 3 volt here okay uh, because i have added already 1.5 offset and i have calibrated likewise because 1.5 to 3 volt i'll get by whenever one uh, 8 ampere current will flow same same will we apply here if i'll get 150 volt dc here because boosted output will be more than double double than your input so 80 to uh, 150 so 150 to 3 volt i am getting here okay so whenever uh, 150 volt uh, will be generated or boosted here we will get 3 volt same my in output current in boost mode will be 3 ampere so whenever 3 ampere will flow at the output side i'll get 0 to 3 volt here because to make it closed loop operation currently i'll explain you two modes bulk mode and boost mode in separate video so thank you